scrappers. Someone asked us about mid-grade boards versus high-grade boards. What's this? What's that? So we just want to give you a little scrap secret on what to look for when you're at the yard. In front of me, I have not one mega board, but four separate boards. So things that you want to look for that would make things low-grade, mid-grade, high-grade. You want to look for gold. You want to look for pins. Now this board, while it is yellow on the back, meaning that all of these are going to be copper and not gold connectors that are actually on the board. You have gold connectors throughout all of these different sockets. You have them all over the place that continue all in here. This is where video cards would go or graphics cards. This, while it could look like a mid-grade board, is a high-grade board because of the amount of gold pins that are all over this board. Now, if you took this board and removed half of them and it looked something like this and it was a blue board, which is generally a Chinese-made board, you would have a lower-grade board. There's less connectors, there's less sockets, there's less gold, there's less silver, which means that there's going to be less value. Generally, a rule of thumb, blue boards, brown boards, yellow boards are low grade boards. They're generally made overseas with very little precious metals. Just to give you a quick comparison here, this is a green motherboard that has some mixed messaging on it, but it does give you a good idea. A couple pieces of memory that you have here, these are silver tipped memory pieces, but still having the memory on this board does make it high grade. This CPU chip that you can pull off, you have gold on one side, you have a piece of ceramic and gold on the other side. These become much more expensive chips instead of your regular CPUs that could have copper on the back. This has gold and gold, but this would be a high grade gold board. You have fingers on the side, you have sockets throughout, memory, CPU chips, and then gold connectors. So when you look for things, look for color. Anything that's not green most likely is going to become low grade or mid grade. That's your first indicator. But look for the amount of pins that are all over these boards. The more gold pins, the more value you're going to have. Any other questions about electronics? Because we know electronics and wire are very hard to figure out. Just let us know. Until next time, I'll scrap you later. Thanks for checking out our scrap videos. By becoming a Patreon supporter today, you'll be entered into monthly giveaways for tools and other products to help you make more money with your scrap.